Yo, what's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel and in today's video I'm going to show you guys some methods on how to fix a slow slash not working file explorer on Windows 10. So let's get right into it. Okay, so in case your file explorer is not working at all and you do not have this taskbar over here and a background, what you want to do is go ahead and press Control shift escape and then your task manager will open up. Then what you want to do is go ahead and left click on file and then click on run new task. Then you want to type in explorer.x or just explorer and then click on create this task with administrative privileges and click on OK. Okay, so once you've done that, now we are going to take a look at how to make your file explorer run much faster and not crash so many times. So what you want to do is go ahead and open up your file explorer and then you want to go ahead and make sure that there's enough free space on your local disk. Now what you want to do is you want to go ahead and look for the disk that has this little windows icon right over here and you want to make sure that that one has enough free space. So once you've checked that and uh, everything has a decent amount of free space, you can go ahead and do the following thing. Now what you want to do is you want to go ahead and head over into description and there will be a address for your file explorer in there. You want to go ahead and copy it. Okay, so once you've copied it, you want to click right over here and then click on control V and paste it right over here and then click on enter. What you want to do then is go ahead and click on one of them and then just click control A. So you select all of them and then click on delete. Once you've done that, you can close out of this and see whether your problem is fixed or not. If it's not fixed, go ahead and follow the next method. Okay, so what you want to do is go ahead and head over onto the search bar and search for indexing options and click on open. What you want to do then is left click on advanced and then click on rebuild and then just click on OK and wait until it is done. Okay, so once it is done, go ahead and check whether it is fixed or not. And if it's still not fixed, there's one last thing you can do. And that is just go ahead and open up your file explorer. Then right click on quick access and click on options. Then click on view and then make sure that launch folder window in a separate process is checked. And then just click on apply and then click on OK. Now go ahead and check whether it is fixed or not. And if it's still not fixed, this might actually be an issue with your uh, PC itself or something is just updating or downloading you can see that by opening up your task manager once again and then look if anything is using your disk um, for like more than 20 percent and if it is then that will probably be your issue okay so that's it for today's video hope this video was helpful if this video was helpful please drop a like and subscribe to my channel and if it was not helpful let me know in the comments what your problem is and i will try to help you out see you guys in the next video